And here's Max. Happy birthday, boy. Tell him happy birthday. This is a birthday boy. <laughs> okay. I'm wearing that boucle vest that I got from Koss and the bracelet I got from Essence. This jacket is from Zara and the bag from Bottega. For my first request, I asked for fish and chips. They're so good here. So freaking good. All juicy like you. <laughs> Cheers to you, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, I'm not exaggerating. This is the best tuna tartare I've ever had in my life. It comes with like this crunchy stuff and you eat it with the avocado and tuna. It just melts. Good morning! It's sunny and extremely cold here today in Montreal. Today is Super Bowl Sunday and very last minute Max decided that he wants to host a Super Bowl thing. So we invited a couple of friends over. We're gonna order some food, fried food, and we're gonna eat good today. I just finished cleaning the whole apartment. It's looking snazzy. And now I just need to get a bit of work done for the YouTubes. I know it's a Sunday. I shouldn't be working, but boys gotta do what a boys gotta do. Shirtless husband cleaning. That's one of your fantasy. Drop your pants. Drop your pants and clean me. <laughs> what is that sound? <laughs> it's the pick popping sound. Okay. We got more pink tulips for Valentine's. I mean, this is just like a Costco flower. By Phil Valentine's. I'm not like crazy about red roses. And since we had that pink tulips two, three weeks ago, I'm so in love. I think these are like my new favorite flowers. Look how pretty they are. These ones are smaller than the other ones we got. They're twink tulips. Okay, I'm getting bored, so I'm cutting all three at once. So pretty. Oh my God. I'm scrambling right now because you randomly just said we have to go right now. Surprise Valentine dinner. I'm not ready. Are you excited to know where it is? I hope I'm dressed correctly. Yeah, you are. This is exciting, but I wish I had planned my outfit better. But it's Valentine's Day. You thought you were just gonna stay in PJ all day? Yeah. Bar George. Here's what I found for Bar George. That's where we eat. Yo, that's sick. What is this place? Our George. Old rustic place. Oh my god, babe. Come with me. Okay. So the restaurant seems to be divided in like several different rooms. It's like someone's house. It looks like a downtown Abbey house. And this is the room that we got. I think it's like zebra themed. I know you love your uh, Duncan Abbey. Cheers. Cheers. Sante. Happy Valentine's Day. I can't believe you're my Valentine. Yeah, that I do. 
feel like we're in a castle or something. I feel like we're, yeah. I feel like we don't like belong here. <laughs> yeah, of course you belong, baby. Anything for you? What? What's, what's, what's that? that? <laughs> Look at that. Why are there just two white guys? This is really creepy. It feels like we're invading someone's house. Yeah, we're not we're not drunk at all. <laughs> we're not supposed to be here. It felt so cool though. Uh, can I have a kiss? All right, let's go back to the bar. So this is so illegal. <laughs> Wait, look at look at that. Oh my god! Wow, it's a private set. This has to be haunted. <laughs> it has to be haunted. Say Bloody Mary three times in the mirror. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Hey y'all, we're gonna do our usual haul. Today I'm joined with my husband because he bought some stuff as well. And you never joined me in a haul, so. Mm -hmm. Today is a special day. I want to show you guys the birthday presents that I got. My friend Ali got me this Tamagotchi. I can't with it. I keep beeping non-stop. It's so cute. Because of this, I started playing with my other Tamagotchis. And then because of that, I also got another one. It's a new Digimon. <laughs> you need help. <laughs> no, I don't. And then this one also from our friend Yachi. She got me the R2D2 Tamagotchi. Don't you love that everyone's getting me what I love? Mm -hmm. And you got some cologne over there. Yeah. You didn't get me any present. Well, I want, no, that's not true. I took you shopping. You didn't want to get anything that day. I guess I couldn't figure out what I want yet. But I think I know now. It's going to be a pair of shoes. Okay, let's go get them. It's heels. No. Oh hell no. <laughs> okay. I think I'm gonna get like a sneaker, like a cool sneaker. Mm. Uh, our friend Danny got me this. This is the Burberry, I think Burberry London for her. It smells so good. I've been wearing it every day. Too strong for me. It's a bit ladyish, but uh, it is ladyish. Right. Super floral. Like I don't like it when it's wet. Oh, I don't like most perfumes when it's wet, right? But once it dries down, mm -hmm. it dries down really pretty. If you don't put too much, it's fine. The piece that I got was this jacket right here. Another bummer, because you know I love bummer jacket. You, you have like a collection of them. <laughs> Any black or white t-shirt and just throw a bummer on top of it. You know? I'll wear nothing underneath. Yeah, right. Yeah. I went for it because of the color. I think it's so cute. That is such a cute color. I'm not usually going for color, but I like blue. Yeah. And it goes with my eyes. Aren't you getting lost in my blue eyes? Wait, your eyes are gray. They're gray. <laughs> Oh, they're blue. <laughs> they're blue, grayish blue. And a pair of chino to go with it. You got this from Koss. By the way, we met our subscriber, Betty, when we were there. Hi, Betty, if you're watching this, we love you. Max is so fussy when it comes to pants. You're actually fussy with anything. But for some reason, like Club Monaco and Koss always works for you. I just don't like shopping in general. You love shopping. But no, because every time I try clothes. What kind of person who hates shopping like always comes out with something new like every single I week. don't, you do. <laughs> yeah. I didn't pick any of those for you. But you well, pick those for yourself. I mean, it's so hard for me to find something that fits me well. It's because you look like a Dorito. I'm looking like a Dorito who's pregnant. So I got something else from the Essence sale from Essence.com. This one is from a brand called Daniel W. Fletcher. This caught my eye because I saw Jenny from Blackpink kind of wear something a bit similar, but hers was navy and not from this brand. But I just love the white stitching on it. I just think it's such a interesting looking like black pants and it fits me so baggy. I'm gonna keep wearing it like this for a while because I think the baggy look is like cool right now. But when I get sick of it, I can always just like hem it, just take it in a little bit and it'll look really fitted and nice. And for once, I have a pair of pants that fits me like perfectly on the waist. And it's high-waisted, so it looks good when I tuck things in. You've been loving your mom jeans lately. These are not mom jeans. <laughs> Baggy jeans. No, they're not. They're just straight cut jeans. You guys should comment. Do you prefer him, do you prefer him in skinny jeans or mom jeans? These I prefer the skinny jeans. These are straight cut jeans. <laughs> You're trying so hard to be straight, yes. Okay. This next thing is from Cost, and if you don't already have this, run. 
run and get one because it's so good. The material is so soft. It's just like this basic long sleeve tee, right? Like it looks so basic, but the cut of it when I put it on is so flattering. The neck is a bit wider than like your usual like top. And then it's nice and flowy and the material is holy fuck. It's so soft. I tried to get one in like the short sleeve, but they were sold out. I feel like I'm in like a, a cult when I wear it. Like I'm about to get baptized, but in a really cool and chic way. I'm gonna try my jacket. I can't wait to wear it. Yeah, like he, he wore it to Walmart yesterday for like apparently no reason whatsoever. It was like negative nine degrees Celsius. It was underneath my winter jacket. <laughs> Alright, well, that's all for this week. Um, Hold on. What? Did you enjoy your Valentine's Day dinner? It was, it was like a solid eight. I docked one point off because it was expensive and I docked another point off because you didn't give me time to get ready. Yeah, it was a good dinner. And Yos got tipsy. We all know how it turned out. I'm glad you like your Valentine's Day. I love you. I love you. I'm still waiting for my birthday gift. Come. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Bye.